here we are in front of Zenith Aircraft Company with uh, the Stoll CH-750 and our new uh, Cruiser uh, CH-750 aircraft. Now obviously with the Cruiser airplane we know that it has a very different airfoil on it uh, optimized for cruise performance and the Stoll airplanes they have their uh, characteristic uh, leading edge uh, slat uh, configuration. And on the new uh, Stoll CH-750 since we've introduced the Cruiser we've uh, really worked hard at making it even more stole and uh, we've repositioned the slats. Roger from the factory will explain to us a little bit about what we've done recently with it. Hi, what we've done is we've repositioned the slats on the 750 stole. The previous position was level with the bottom of the wing. What we've done now is we've dropped the slats down an inch and a half from the, from the bottom of the wing. What this is going to do is when, the, when you're starting to rotate, the, the stabilizer's inverted so you can get the rear fuselage down at a slower airspeed. Then the slats are gonna start grabbing the air a little sooner as a Venturi effect and pushing that air very fast over the top of the wing. Before, I was getting about a 30 degree angle of attack. Now it's about 35. So I can come in a lot slower and a lot steeper angle for a short takeoff and landings. Well, let's uh, take this out flying with the new slap position to uh, demonstrate some of the good uh, short takeoff and landing capabilities that this uh, Zenith Stoll CH-750 has. Angle of attack about 